Hello all, my name is Krishnang and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are basically going to discuss how to learn data science for free. Now, when I say for free, as you know that there are a whole lot of materials available in the internet with respect to Python programming language, with respect to data science, with respect to machine learning, AI, deep learning, and a whole lot of stuff. So what I'll do is that in this particular session, I'll show you a systematic way how you can basically complete your data science syllabus within three months so that your transition towards data science can be possible just within three months. And after that, what you can do is that you can also attend interviews by updating your resume. Now resume part will be discussed later on in the upcoming videos, but today we'll just try to focus how to learn data science for free. I'll show you the systematic way, what all YouTube channels you can basically follow, you know, because there are a lot of YouTube channels which provide free materials with respect to Python, machine learning, deep learning and all. Apart from that, you, I'll also be mentioning about various blogs and at finally, I'll also be mentioning about the best machine learning book that you can basically use in order to learn data science machine learning very easily. Now to begin with guys, <clears throat> so I have already prepared the Word doc over here in my laptop and this particular uh, Word doc, I'll actually upload it in my Google Drive and share with all of you and that will basically be given in the description box. Now in this particular video, I'm basically going to tell you that how we are going to do, how we are going to learn data science with respect to machine learning and deep learning considering Python programming language. Uh, the reason I'm telling about Python programming language is guys, because I have an expert in Python programming language. I have referred a lot of materials, I have referred a lot of things and I've also done a lot of st self study. So uh, that is the reason why I'm actually telling you this. For our programming language, I need to do a little bit more research which are the best materials. But apart from that, all the machine learning, deep learning techniques for learning purpose, you can basically use this materials, use this links that I'm basically giving you. But for the practical applications, you have to be, you have, to, you should be able to search through various uh, internet resources. Okay. So to begin with, first of all, as this is for Python programming language, the first topic that I will take is basically from where we can basically run Python. We can basically learn Python. Sorry. So I had two channels in my like most most of the time I referred this channels whenever I wanted to learn about Python, whenever I had some queries. And the best part of this particular channel, these two channels are that in Python, as you know, if you're learning data science, you should just not know Python. You should also know object oriented features in Python. Apart from that, you should also know some other frameworks like Flask and Django, because these two frameworks are very, very important for deployment of machine learning models and deep learning models. Okay. Uh, during the deployment stage, you know that you create a Flask framework or a Django framework and you just upload it in, in some other servers, let it be. Uh, a platform as a service server, it may be an infrastructure as a service server like EC2 instance of AWS or Heroku platform and many more platforms are there. But initially the web framework is basically created, the microservice framework is basically created with the help of Flask or Django. So this channel, the first channel that I like to mention is Corey Schaffer. He's a wonderful person. He used to work uh, in an IT company before, but later on he moved into teaching into YouTube channel itself. He has one of the best Python videos guys. Uh, the link is basically given in the description. Uh, I mean, in the word doc in the description. So you can basically refer the YouTube channel of his link. And I would suggest you, if you have any queries, go and see that particular channel with respect to Python. And it is started from basic, from the basic installation part. Okay. Now in that particular channel, you'll also find a playlist on Flask and Django. So this was one of the uh, favorite channel that I also refer for learning Python. So that is Corey Schaffer. The second person is basically sent Dex. Okay. Sent Dex is one of the oldest YouTuber who uploads videos on machine learning, deep learning, Python, natural language processing. So he's also one of my favorite, uh, YouTuber and, uh, he's a very simple guy. Very, 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 uh, you know, uh, if I see him, I, I really get that motivation motivation because he provides every materials, uh, every videos that he upload. He does not have any online tutorial sites. Uh, he just has some sites where he'll be writing basically about the blogs of whatever he's doing in his YouTube channel. So refer that sent Dex. And again, the link will be given in that particular word doc itself. Now, once you learn Python programming language, okay, now Python programming language, I think if you set, uh, and guess guys, this, this, if you're planning to cover this in three months, make sure you give three to four hours daily. Okay. Give three to four hours. And I'm, when I'm saying give three to four hours, that should be more productive hours. Okay. Now, after this, uh, 
now once you finish python programming language now the next thing is that you move towards machine learning now i know that many of them will ask me question uh, ask me ask me a question saying that where is the math part where is the linear algebra part where should we learn it from where should we learn it, uh, the uh, differential calculus and many more things right uh, statistics parts and all guys don't go in that particular way we need to complete the data science syllabus within three months so what you do is that pick up the machine learning algorithm and through reverse engineering understand the maths and try to derive take a use case how to solve it and finally uh, solve that particular use case try to optimize that particular use case try to increase the accuracy so while you're doing this all the steps you will be uh, means you will be learning statistics you will be learning linear algebra you'll be learning differential calculus wherever it is required always do that reverse engineer get that knowledge you know now suppose if i want to solve linear regression now when i'm learning linear regression i know that there will be an equation of straight line that will be coming into that particular algorithm like y is equal to mx plus c then after that I will be saying I'll be just finding out I'll be deep diving how do I find out that coefficient value then over there the gradient descent come into existence then I learn about how this value is basically calculated through differential calculus I'm just taking as in one one as an example about linear regression similarly you have to learn with respect to each and every algorithm so for this I have actually again selected three channel one is you need to understand the maths behind each and every algorithm so you can basically refer uh, machine learning course by andrew ng in applied ai so deeplearning.ai sorry not applied ai deeplearning.ai channel you can basically uh, and again the link is basically given in the word doc itself uh, the other thing is that i have also uploaded many videos on machine learning and uh, some of the uh, feedback that i got that the machine learning playlist is not that ordered you know so what what you can do is that whenever you're searching my videos suppose you are learning simple linear regression just search that keyword and just put my name in front of that you will be getting the whole explanation apart from that i have also uploaded videos with respect to practical application okay so you'll be able to do that now i am trying to order that particular playlist and i'm, ma I'm making sure that whatever videos that i upload in the future that will also be ordered so uh I would like to say one is Andrew NG, one is my channel with respect to machine learning. If you just want to know the maths about each and every machine learning algorithm, go and see Andrew NG from uh, deeplearning.ai. And then you also have Sentdex channel. Again, I'm referring Sentdex because he has uploaded videos on Python, he's uploaded videos on Flask, Django. Apart from that, he's also uploaded videos with respect to your uh, machine learning algorithms okay and uh, the best part is that he's not uploaded machine learning only he has uploaded deep learning also so i'm going to refer him again in the later uh, links uh, when i'm discussing about deep learning so uh, machine learning three things one is my channel one is sent text and the other one is andrew ng for applied uh, for deep learning dot ai and uh, um, you know andrew ng has explained the complete maths Sometimes what happens is that you will not be able to follow it. But again, if you just see again and again, you'll be able to follow it because uh, the maths is pretty much simpler. But what I'm making sure that in my channel, so I'll be uploading a lot of maths thing whenever I'm explaining you about some specific algorithms and that will be continue going on. In Andrew NG channel uh, uh, of deeplearning.ai, you'll not find any practical applications. So for the practical application, you can either refer my videos or you can refer send text videos. Okay, over there, send text do not explain you the maths behind any machine learning algorithms since is more focused towards implementation of machine learning algorithms okay so uh, this was one now i have also seen some people who gets really attracted just not by seeing writings equation they like some animation kind of explanation so if you want some animation kind of explanation there is one channel that i uh, went through is stat quest with josh stammer okay uh, so, so this is one of the good channel uh, where they'll show a lot of animation to explain you each and every machine learning algorithm uh, with, uh, you know, uh, along with the explanation, the theoretical explanation, how it is basically done, including all statistics, linear algebra, differential calculus, and different kind of math formula. Again, the link is basically given in the doc file itself. Okay. Then after that, uh, you have natural language processing. Uh, natural language processing, you can basically go through my uh, playlist because I have uploaded around eight to nine videos with respect to machine learning. And I'm planning to upload with respect to deep learning also, where I'll be implementing a lot of NLP things. Uh, where I'll be implementing with the help of word to vec and all the different kind of uh, tools or uh, libraries that are basically present in li natural language processing. The other channel is basically again Sentex. Uh, Sentex has been up has uploaded around 20 to 30 videos with respect to natural language processing. Again, you can refer that also. 
now we let us go to the deep learning for deep learning i i, I have selected two channels one is andrew ng again from deep learning.ai again any theoretical components any theoretical things that you need to understand about deep learning you can basically refer that link again just watch uh, the word doc file again uh, in that i have uh, mentioned the link also the second channel is my channel because uh deep learning my deep, complete deep learning playlist uh, that i have created is completely in order okay tutorial one tutorial two tutorial three like that i have I have actually created tutorial 22 and i am including both maths understanding of the algorithms understanding about neural networks and how to implement that with the help of keras and python right so i have done that i have ordered it you know first of all i explained you about all the artificial in, uh, in, uh, sorry not artificial intelligence artificial neural network and in artificial neural network i have explained about a lot of things like back propagation how to update weights bias all those things and i'm also showing it practically how you can basically use for practical implementation with the help of keras apart from that how can you basically optimize your problem statement also now apart from that you can basically refer my channel trust me guys i'm also going to complete the whole deep learning playlist still there are 15 to 20 uh, videos so total overall this play playlist will be having 40 videos okay which will be including lstm rnn cnn everything okay everything ann and I'm, I'm 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 serious about it because i started that playlist till now 22 videos has been completed and i have still have plans to upload more and more uh, now after learning all this uh, you'll be having a lot of idea and I, this particular whole uh, whatever i have explained is with respect to youtube channel right now okay the whole lot of materials that are available in youtube and the next thing is that you refer github links you know github links so suppose if you have a problem with about linear regression go and search linear regression github okay so you'll be getting various abundant materials in the uh, google uh, in the google search itself and you can basically take one of the problems start solving it now the next thing is that after after learning all the skills you have to do a lot of practice projects right so i have created one deep learning uh, sorry data science project playlist wherein i have uploaded more than 50 videos 50 different use cases and that is specifically kaggle use cases that i have taken i've solved with the help of python and machine learning and deep learning so you can basically refer those projects try to solve it again all the code is basically given in the github itself you can refer my github and you can get up all the details okay so uh, after learning all these things the last part is data science projects you should be able to implement various data science projects and finally create your resume you know include everything that you have learned into your resume that's it now first we have discussed about youtube channels now second thing is that i'm also going to refer some of the blogs which has all almost all of the problem solutions of every machine learning algorithms or deep learning algorithms one is towards data science blog and the other one is medium uh, with respect to machine learning and deep learning so all the links is basically given in the word doc itself okay so in short this was there and the last part is basically about books now one of the best machine learning book that i have also read you know uh, the link is basically given in the description uh, about the best machine learning book it is basically written uh, for the o'reilly publisher uh, if you go and see that particular book, this book has the best book, guys. Best book of machine learning and deep learning. I think every fresher, every fresher who wants to make the transition towards their data science, machine learning, I think they should go and read this particular book. And this book is basically, uh, you know, a boon to all the data scientists because the author, uh, uh, his basically Aurelian Giron. Sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong but uh, this particular person has written this book and it is basically the book name is hands on machine learning with skykit learn and tensorflow okay again the link is basically given in the description and uh, the the publisher name is o'reilly and i'll tell you this book is very cheap guys uh, i uh, see there are a lot of free pdfs also available for this book uh, i don't want to share that pdfs i don't want to, don't want to research and find out the free pdfs over there because this guy has written this author has written this book so nicely and i don't want to disrespect him by just taking the free pdfs and distributing it to you okay i have not even researched and found out whether there is any free pdf or not i basically download i basically bought this book uh, the paperback bag version and uh, i'll just uh, if you want i can also review this particular book in one of my next uh, videos uh, but awesome book you know it is basically you have python you have feature engineering you have machine learning you have everything okay and about apart from that guys uh, you can buy this book and it is hardly around 1500 rupees inr uh, if you consider this in the terms of dollar hardly 10 to 15 dollars 
uh, 15 to 20 dollars so i think yes 15 to 20 dollars you can basically buy this particular book again the link is basically given in the description go ahead and buy it i know this particular session is all about data science with respect to free but uh, i'd suggest uh, this particular book uh, uh, you know don't search for free pdfs keep this book handy because it will help you for the lifetime okay whenever you want you can basically read this now the next thing comes that there are small small parts like feature engineering feature selection what you have to do is that uh, i'll be sharing a very good github link uh, about feature engineering and feature selection which i found it through the internet and i'll be sharing that link in this word doc itself what you have to do is that go inside that link there are many materials present inside just refer each and every uh, notebook file it is clearly written what what is all about feature engineering how feature engineering is basically done similarly there are around 10 to 20 materials uh, notebook file jupyter notebook files you can just you just have to read it just have to execute that and by that you'll be able to understand a lot of things and similarly for the feature selection so i'll be sharing those two github link and uh, thanks to the author i'll also be mentioning the author over there uh, who had actually provided those materials and it is available in internet completely for free so i'll be providing that two things uh, to you and yes that is all about this particular preparation guys and i think if you are able to give around two to three to four hours i think within three months you'll be able to complete this whole data science syllabus and after three months you'll be also giving the interviews because you have learned a lot of things you have done data science projects you have practiced things in kaggle and make sure uh, you practice a lot of projects after completing all these things through this youtube channel through blogs through this particular book that i have told you uh, uh, from o'reilly publisher uh, which is basically hands-on machine learning with skykid learn and tensorflow uh, that was all about this particular video i hope you like this particular video share with all your friends subscribe do subscribe to the channel if you are not already subscribed i'll see you all in the next video have a great day ahead thank you